Hey guys, and welcome to yet another bigger opening of packs. Well, I guess not just packs, the Evertel Elite Trainer Box. Right, so um, I already took off the packaging because I'm just dead, can I get? Um, so we have a nice little um, look, out, look at the box right here. And at the back, you'll see what you get, or a w well, what is included in your wonderful little elite trainer box if you decide to get it um cameras having oh yeah now it's focuses god damn it focus right um so just before we start listing all these things i just have to tell you that i'm a bit under the weather but i thought you guys still deserve this kind of uh booster pack opening right so in each box you will find eight pokemon tcg x and y booster packs these will be my first so i might get the card trick wrong 45 Pokemon TCG energy cards, including fairy type energy, which has been included. Two acrylic can condition markers. Um, I guess that's for poison and burn. Then we have six damage counter dice. Uh, I guess for some special moves, a competition legal coin flip die. An awesome player's guide. So just for those who don't really uh, play the TCGs uh, well competitively and then I'll say oh maybe I'll try it out um, 65 Pokemon TCG X and Y card sleeves 4 dividers and a collector's box to hold everything right here we have a nice little look let's just, just open it right here oh and it's quite big as you can see uh, compared to a booster pack, but well, that seems to be reasonable. Let's just put that aside for a sec. Trico's just like, what the fuck is going on here? Right, so this is the player's guide. Um, it says, like, welcome to the uh, Elite Trainer Box. I guess these will be standard in, everybody, uh, in everybody's Elite Trainer Box, so I don't think they'll have different ones for uh, the different Elite Trainer box cause, Boxes because there are um, two. Xerneas and Evertail, so yeah, and they'll have some showcases like um, Resilient Life and Destruction Rush, those kind of theme decks. All the Mega Evolution cards, Full Art cards, um, I'm hoping to pull any one of those to be honest. A Mega Venusaur seems really like the card I really want to pull. Um, Mega Blastoise is also kind of cool. I think the Japanese already have a new set where they have uh, Mega Charizard X and Mega Charizard Y. So let's just put that aside and have a look at our box. Right, so I don't know what this is for, we'll find that out. Uh, let's just put that aside. Open this bad boy up. Oop, there we go. Pull these out. Oh, now I can already see what the collector's box is. Um, the sleeves, let's, we'll have a look at those in a second. The dividers pack, oop, four dividers. Uh, all the energy cards, I don't think we'll have to go through all those, uh, just 45 of those, just randomly running around. Um, oop, another divider. I kind of like the design that they have. Uh, the, I guess, uh, the dice. Oh, and we have the. Lastly, the two damage, um, not damage, but condition counters, thingy bobs. Right. So, uh, this is also some kind of a uh, card, I guess, storage compatible thingy bob. I think this is how you just um, pop it over. I'm, I'm guessing. Yep. And there you have your own little storage. So that's kind of great. Kind of what? It's awesome. So let's just have a look at the sleeves because these are awesome. I think the the custom with the Elite Trainer Box, so you can't go outside and say, oh, I'd love to have those Evertail or I'd love to have those Xerneas sleeves. Uh, they look awesome. Nope. Chuck Tester. Nope. Chuck Tester, I should say. So let's just open these up. Kind of they look really cool, to be honest. That's why I got the Evertail deck uh, or Elite Trainer Box. Wow, I like the red and gold finish right there. Beautiful, 65 of those, so I guess that's enough for a deck. I don't know how many cards you need for a deck uh, when you play competitively or in tournaments, just in general. So yeah, let's put those aside. And 
Let's get to the packs. Wow, 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 wow. So we have, um, I guess, Me uh, Mega Blastoise, Venusaur, Venusaur, Blastoise, Evotel, Xerneas, Evotel, and Xerneas. So let's just, just, let's just take one of them. Let's just take Xerneas. All right, Xerneas, you seem like an awesome guy. And do you know what, guys? If you've made it uh, through these five minutes of just opening everything else, um, you will be rewarded if you are first because I will um, give you the first code card for free. Yes, you don't have to do shit. <laughs> right, so here is the code card. Here it is. In all its glory. Blah, blah, blah. Yes, first come, first serve. That is my rule when I uh, open packs. So let's just see. One, two, three, two. I'm hoping that's correct. We'll see if it's not. So, right, let's start off. Oh god, Pan Sage. <laughs> Pan Sage. Pikachu. A Grass Energy because we haven't got enough through the Elite Trainer box. Fennekin. Timber. Dance Bars. Oh, they're Dance Bars though. The Roller Skates. Oh god, really need those. Double Colorless NRJ. Ooh, a Reverse Delcatty. Looks awesome. And a regular Rare Stummy. Nice, nice. Um, from what I've heard, the pulls are harder. Oh, I guess the um, like ultra rares and stuff are harder to pull. Oh, shouldn't let that go. That that'd be kind of annoying and kind of uh, unfortunate, I guess. So I got the card trick right. Yes. And god oh, damn it, I'm really bad at opening packs, aren't I? Now I won't give you the second code card because that's just how I roll. All right. One, two, three from the back. And. Let's go. Okay, the first fairy type we get. Swellix. Staryu. Ban Sage. A Slugma. Inkay. Ooh, I like that 3D art design. And then and a double blade or double double blade. It doesn't really matter how you pronounce it. I don't give a damn. Team Flare Grunt. A Girder. Girder. A reverse Whirlipede. Ooh, that's nice. And <laughs> a Scolipede. That's that's awesome. Right. So um, I think hollows are one in five. I think that's been um, changed in these booster packs. I don't know why. This I don't I don't even give a damn. Because if I were to give a damn, damn, I'd be a woman damn. That is correct. Right, let's just chuck that aside. And the code card aside. Um, I don't know. I've got quite a lot. I don't really play the online TCG. Maybe I'll give them away someday. Um, right. <clears throat> Sorry, yet again, I'm under, a bit under the weather, so... Have mercy! Onich. Pansia, I like that design. Skiddo. It's cool, cool. Beedoo. Pumpkaboo. Oh, that's pretty cool with... I like the three the shading a lot, right here. Professor Sycamore. Super Potion. Quilladin. Or Quilladin, really... Doesn't matter how you pronounce it. A Cloister Reverse and a Bishop Regular Rare. Right. Nice, nice, nice regular start we have right here. Hopefully we can find one hollow at least. So, right, so I might, well, I won't, might be, I will be a bit disappointed. But you never know. This is the great thing about packs. You never know what you'll get. Or even if you can actually open the goddamn packs. Oh, Jesus. God damn it. Really bad at opening these. I should really take scissors next time with me. Or a sizzle for that matter. Just to slice through them. Uh, not through the cards. That'd be a bit unnecessary. Right. Oh. Uh oh. Right, we've got a Rhyhorn. A Fennekin. A Jumpluff. Oh, Jigglypuff, sorry. <laughs> Ponyard. Spoink. Electrode. A Dole Blade. A hard charm. Oh, I can already see it. And a reverse illamise and a an amalga EX. Wow. I really like this EX. I like the design. It's shiny. It's shiny. For some reason every pack opening until now has given me a shiny shiny what? Shiny card, I guess. Shiny EX. Not as in shiny Pokemon, but a very shiny, nice to look at card. An EX. Well done, Amolga, you've done your job. Have a seat, have a seat. Have a, just, just have a seat, have a seat. Right, so, 
Let's see what Mega Venusaur, Mega Venusaur has in store for us. Oh god, what is it with me and these packs? I'm so sorry. Let's chuck that side. Code cards away. One, two, three, two, what two? Right. Sendile. Ladybug. Jigglypuff. Venipede. Fairy Energy. A Muscle Band. Crocorock. A Brakeson. Ooh, another Crocorock. Reverse. And an Aegislash. Nice, nice. I like Aegislash. Also competitively in the Pokemon X and Y. It's kind of funny that we haven't found a Hollow yet. Um, but we found an EX, so that's 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 the thing. Oh God, what is what is what? Jesus freaking Christ! This is so fucking hard to open fucking plastic. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus! Right. Oop. Nope. Okay. Nothing. Screwed that up. But hey, yellow. Be Dave. Pumpkin Boo. Bunnelby. Doduo. Scatterbug. Delcatty. A Brakeson. A Dunsparce. A Reverse Kitty. And a Simisi. Nice. Really like the designs of the X and Y cards. Um, I didn't really collect much after the first generation. Kind of just got uninterested, but yeah, that's that's thing. So it's kind of karma that we found Volto, Volto Orb, not Volto Ball. I kind of got that mixed up because last time I had German cards, and I'm sorry about that. But hey, YOLO. Right, so we have a Volto Orb, a Fennekin, Fletchling. I love, oh, I love this card. It's absolutely beautiful. Ponyard. Spunk, Quilladin, Inke, oh, different kind of Inke, I guess. Shadow Circle, a Reverse Spoink, and whoa, a Hollow Greninja. Nice, nice. I like Greninja. Um, I'm really trying to get a shiny one in Pokemon X and Y. Very nice, very nice. So let me just grab one of grab one of those handy dandy X and Y sleeves. Or Evertail sleeves to be precise. Just have a have a seat. Have a seat with a Marga. Just just have a seat. And don't you dare fucking no! Don't fucking fall down, man. Right. Stay. Right. And our last pack. Oh my god. Something's got to be in here. I mean, I opened it directly. Maybe not with style and swag, but hey, Yolo. There's a Taylo. Right. Last pack. Peck, peck, we lost peck for the dynamite. Right. You fucking kidding me, Greninja? Fine, stay down. <laughs> Alright, so, we'll start off with Taylo, a Shelder, Fletchling, Ekans, Panpour, Corsola, Kakuna, Shadow Circle, a Reverse Froakie, and another Stami. So, we'll. End it off where we started off at, at um, Starmie, the rare Starmie, yes, the regular rare, the RR Starmie. Right, I do thank you guys for watching, if you did like the uh, video, leave a like. Yet again, for the third time, I am so sorry if my voice sounds a bit weird, but it does in general, but I'm just sick, so that's an important factor. Right, in general, I would say the Elite Trainer Box is a great way to uh, start off when you want to get into the game I guess if you're a collector or if you want to do some competitive stuff uh, if you're more going to be a competitive player then I'd recommend the theme decks because you have you know a deck that obviously works maybe not perfectly not with the best combinations but it's a decent deck in general right or it doesn't really matter which I guess we'll have to see other reviews I'm not a theme deck person but I just I've, I bought a couple in the past and I was, was quite happy with them. Alright, so yeah. I do thank you guys for watching. And goodbye.